what would you suggest they consider? What would you suggest they do so that they can live a life of resilience like you have and also help others do the same? It's interesting that you bring up that because I knew you as a teacher. I knew you were adored by your students. I also know that you're highly creative. You're very, very creative. Uh, you have the ability really to capture. I can see why students would feel that way with you. You have that ability. Uh, I like your openness. I like your freedom. I like the fact that you think this way. And that's one reason I think your students responded hmm. the way they did with you. This is a great quality. You're asking me. I probably would ask you because the same thing. Because I see in you also the fact that you you really aren't you aren't thinking about you. You're thinking about others, and that's exact. Even with what you're doing now, even what you're planning to do, mm -hmm. is you're not thinking about yourself. I do think that for all of us, that and obviously we have to be concerned about ourselves. I, I have a little tendency leaning away from that. And it comes back to that quote that you had said toward the beginning of this um, particular podcast, which was life isn't about me. It's about others. Correct. And you keep on coming back. I mean, you do, you keep, you live that. But you, so do you. Yeah. Well, so I hope you. so. I hope so.